Welcome summoners to a brand new League of Legends video where today we're going to be playing some Kennen in the top lane going for a nice spicy build. I really like Kennen. He was a champ I played a long long time ago and he's super enjoyable so hopefully you guys enjoy this one and hopefully we can make some plays. Be pretty awesome. I want to get this empowered W onto the uh, Amumu if we can. There we go. That way we can miss a minion which is great. Oh my gosh, we missed so many minions. Pretty good damage, but we need to hit these minions. There we go. Let's get really aggressive here. He's only level... Uh... Okay, he's actually not really... He's doing a lot better in CS, I'll tell you that much. I can say he's not really uh, fighting back. He just kind of soaks up a lot of the damage. Oh my gosh, our minion count is terrible. Well, on the bright side, we have a HP lead, right? No, it's not really that good, to be honest. You need a minion lead. Only if you can kind of translate your HP lead into something, then it's good. But yeah, build should be kind of fun. Going for like an on-hit style uh, build with Conqueror. And hopefully we can make it work. We know Lilia's popping bot side, so if you're kind of safe here. I feel like she's popping bot side because we saw the Amumu. Oh my gosh. Ooh, first blood already in the mid lane. Okay. Traded back by the Warwick. Nice stuff. Ah, we barely missed that minion. Maxing W is usually quite good on Kennen, to be honest. Oh my gosh, our CSing is so bad, guys. And our queuing as well, apparently. He's probably going to reset. He only has 8 minions. Imagine if we actually hit all of our CS. Nice. Canceling that recoil is pretty big, in my opinion. Oh my goodness, guys. We cannot last it. If you guys are new to the video, uh, yeah, this is normal. <laughs> we can't last it, but nice stuff. Get away, push in. We should have a much bigger lead, but hey, it is what it is. He did TP back. This will give us a TP advantage thanks to us uh, pushing in the wave. We'll get double attack speed. Run up top side. So now if we get our Merc Boots and we get Wits End, it's going to be a lot of tenacity, which is going to be huge. So it's going to be hard to lock us down. We have a good amount of magic distance as well. Looks like there's a uh, 3v3 in the bot lane. Nice flash from the smallest secure kill onto the Rakan. Warwick's going to walk forward. Unfortunately, he's not going to be able to do enough damage in time. Lux is there as well to turn the numbers in the enemy's favor, which is a little bit unfortunate. But yeah, Lux is going to be able to turn the tide. It's kind of rambo -y down there. Kind of messy. Nice. Secure cannons. Never miss those. Another point into W. W max, in my opinion, is better than uh, key max. Especially if you can't hit keys like me. Nice. We can slow push this wave out. Look for a play onto the uh, Amumu, potentially. A jungle is going to be able to come round. Nice, we get a stun off, which is huge. Can we kill this guy? Nice. Awesome. And he's got no TP as well. Nice play from the Warwick to actually help us out with the uh, TM out there. We're going to go ahead and leave as well. Well played, my friend. Oh, can we come and help him? Um, I might TP to help him. I got three parts. I'm going to make my way here. I should have sold these to get... I didn't have enough time to buy. I really wanted to help the Warwick here instead. Wanted to save my TP as well, but maybe it's best to help out my team when possible. That's fine. He helped me. He helps me out. I try and help him out. Oh, we missed that Q. No way. I actually play a Mumu top as well. Or I used to play a Mumu top, should I say. And maybe it's... Uh, Another champ we'll have to try out in the top side. Oh my gosh. Man, that should be so much further ahead. Oh, what am I doing? Guys, I'm not even going to make the excuse that I'm not warm. Because I am not warm. 
Nice. Okay, he gets traded back. That's huge. Oh my goodness. I mean, he does a ton of damage, huh? This minion wave won't hold, but hopefully we can get up there quick enough. See, if I save my TP, it would have been really good. But like I said, I wanted to help my jungler and it's kind of bit me in the butt now. It would have been nice if I saved that. I could have TP'd up, got a really nice lead, but now I'm going to miss all this CS because of it. That's fine. Looks like another 3 3 on the bot side of the map. What looks like he's going, looks like he's going to go down. Tries to flash forward to try and maybe play. play. Oh no, he just, he just keyed forward, I think, actually. That's where another point into Q would have been nice, so we could have got that minion. All right, let's continue to chill for the meantime. We need to poke out the Amumu, of course, before we get into a long exchange like that. Fortunately, the tower did take him down in that case, but we need to be a little bit careful. What did he get? Bra uh, Bammies. Okay, interesting. Some magic resistance would have been really good for him. Obviously against me, but also for the Warwick. Warwick does quite a lot of magic damage. Okay, not good. Bot lane looking a little rough. Smolder the scale really, really well. Which is nice, but... Getting aggressive, poking him down a little bit, getting the Conqueror proc actually, which is quite nice. Not sure if Lily is going to be up here now. If she is, we might be in a little bit of trouble. want to go for the uh, plate if I can. Do need some good vision coverage here though. Oh, who was it up here? Was it a Mimu again? No way. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me Lilia's there. I have to be careful of a Mimu here. Okay, it should be a dead Mimu, which is pretty good. Nice. Well played, my friend. Uh, I'll probably hard push this wave out. I put another point into E here. Nice. Let's go. Do I get the plate? Oh, I can get the plate as well. Why not? It's really greedy for us, but getting this plate would be quite nice. We're going to miss out on a wave as it bounces back, probably. But we do have the wits then. That's going to help out CC-wise. We do have free boots as well, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, which we're going to get right about now. So we'll get this. We'll get the extra... No magic mantle. Nice. And then on our way to top side, we'll get the boots. I'm going to be looking good. There's the boots coming in now. Awesome stuff. And then from here, getting Nash is probably quite nice. I want to get something with HP. I might go for a Titanic. Might try that out. We don't have much HP though other than Titanic. So maybe it's not going to be worth. It's good if you're stacking HP, but not really stacking HP. Extra AD would be nice though. Our W scales of AD, which is awesome. Not sure where the Amumu is. Oh, he's actually mid. He's coming back, so I'm not going to hard push it. It's going to still go kind of slow here. Not sure if I saw the Lilia bot. Oh, I did. Nice. It actually looks pretty good, to be honest. I don't have my ult up there. Hmm. Oh, he lands it. No way. <laughs> Barely get it traded back. I think I could have lived. I just had to play it slightly better. But that's alright. Nice fight. I need to dodge the Qs as well. The extra magic resistance is coming in handy. If I had Nashes, might have been a little bit better. Maybe we'll get Nashes next just for the extra ability power. And the attack speed would be quite nice. But I kind of don't want to because I want to go for Terminus here. Terminus is going to be really, really nice, I feel. The extra AD is going to scale pretty nicely. I was thinking about going bot side here. Did he TP? I don't know if he TP'd. 
Uh, but yeah, I don't have ult. Be a nice opportunity to ult there. Get the shutdown on Desire potentially. But yeah, without ult, it's going to be a little bit difficult to do that, I think. It's going to be a bit tough. Cannon minion. Focus. No! It's because I zoomed in. Oh no. Oh no. I thought I could do it with a zoom in, but clearly not. Alright, another point in the queue for now. Not sure if Lilia is around, but we're going to put another pink ward here for the meantime. Get some deep vision to see if Lilia is around. Ooh, nice stuff. Oh, I thought... Yeah, nice. I was going to say, I thought he would ult. Awesome. Really good play. Get the uh, Lilia for free, which is huge. Warwick could come topside as well. Yeah, Mimu looks like he's going to leave, which is a smart play, probably. Nice. Oh, Lux is here. Nice. Lux being here is a little bit of a pain, unfortunately. I saw her with the shield, and it's why I didn't walk forward a little bit further. Got double buffs too now. Scary. Alright, let's leave. Terminus, like I said, it's going to be super, super nice. Not going to have enough for the Nimbus Cloak. The Nimbus Cloak. The half-bound axe just yet. I'll well, we get this and this. Awesome stuff. Run back up topside. Bot lane managed to get a kill as well, which is pretty good. We need, do need to be able to kill Lux later into the game, though. TP coming in from a Mumu into the mid lane. Interesting. Is Victor going to be okay here? Yeah, I think he's going to be fine. Mumu's got his Hollow Radiance now. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's gone. Uh, I can use this opportunity just to push out top wave. Maybe get a pl Oh no, the plates are going to run out. I was going to say, oh, I can get a plate for myself. We give up the Drake for sure. I'll just trade top side here. Smart my team not to do anything. It's a little bit unfortunate there's no plates for me to get. Nice. Pretty good. Damage is nice. Damage is good, my friends. Ooh, play from the Warwick onto the Lux here. Managed to get the ult onto her, which is pretty good. Can uh, Victor follow up? Yes, he does. Follows up pretty nicely. That's a Lux going down. Shutdown going over to the Victor, which is huge. Help him get back into the game a little bit more. No. That's why we should have max cute. No. I could TP bot, potentially. Okay, looks like they have it covered. I was just thinking about it. This ward would have been good if they walked up towards tower a little bit more. Nice. Good dodge. Really aggressive play for me, to be honest. Nice, get the stun, which is huge. Got the Conqueror proc as well. Looking pretty good for us. Just gotta keep my range here. Nice, let's go. Get the flash auto. Oh! Go away, Lux. Oh my goodness, what a pain. Very painful, very annoying, but really nice play from the Warwick. Managed to secure ourselves two kills. Lux coming in to. Oh, does Victor maybe get the kill? Does he have ult? He does. Nice play. I think Victor can maybe secure this. Needs his next rotation of spells. Nice. Well played, Victor. I wanted to get this red buff, actually, that was here, but it's timed out now. Um, we can still TP. Oh, no, we can't TP now. I was going to say, oh, we can maybe TP bot side. We'll just go mid here. I could TP here. That was a deep ward, maybe. How much do I need for Terminus? About 650 gold. Okay. How much has this done? 1k damage. That's going to scale up quite nicely. It's obviously not really good to get Wits End first normally. It's good to get it second. Okay. 
I want to go bot here, but I don't have my ult. So we'll quickly clear this out. Maybe go top side here. I've got my ult now. Or coming up now for bot side, maybe. I don't want to overextend the uh, mid lane, which is why I didn't really... Go ahead and ult this guy. Oh my gosh, Lux is so annoying. Nice, good stuff. Get his flesh out of him as well, which is huge. Lux is a pain. Getting the kill onto the Amumu is huge. But Lux makes it very difficult sometimes. Right, let's go ahead and push us in now. Have enough for Terminus. We'll push one more wave in. Warwick's going to go bot side here. We can still TP bot potentially. Nice Q from the Warwick. E as well, probably CC. I can't really see what's going on there because I'm going to push this wave in for now. Okay, looks like no one dies in the end. But Smolder's getting pretty strong, especially with the Yumi. Going to be pretty good in terms of uh, later game insurance. They do manage to get a kill in the 3v3, which is pretty big. So well played team. We're just going to reset and get our Terminus. Let the wave crash. Moon is going to be back in time probably for us to... Uh, to mean that we don't do too much for the tower even. We get this. Nice. Now getting a little bit of HP would be nice. Maybe Jaxxia would be pretty good actually. Or Leandri's. Leandri's pretty nice. He's getting a Warden's Mail. Okay. He will need the armor for sure but... I'm just going to go for the pink ward again. Put himself in a bad spot, to be honest. He might actually go down here. Yeah, it's going to leave this uh, these minions. Let's get the Warwick. The Warwick? Get the Amumu, even. Nice. Huge stuff. Amumu not looking too hot now. Getting some uh, lifesteal would be good. Maybe Riftmaker. Oh, Riftmaker would be cool. We can get Riftmaker, guys. Why didn't I think of that? I know we don't really have HP. We get bonus AP based on the HP, right? But it's the Omni Vamp we want. The Omni Vamp's going to be cool. Let's get that. Oh my gosh, Lux. Go away. My goodness. They actually get the Drake as well. That's rough. I can TP behind them here, potentially, which I'm going to do. Uh, don't have enough for it, unfortunately. can save my R here, which is huge. Nice. Glad I got a kill for that. Going to go for a Lux here. Like I said, Riftmaker is probably to play into a Jack Show. Does Lux maybe go bot here, or...? Nice. Revenge for the Lux. Revenge on the Lux, even, not for the Lux. Gosh, my English is worse than normal, guys, which is not very good, but our plays are decent this game, which is awesome. Let's go ahead and push in the mid lane. Really nice play from the Victor here. I like him going topside to push out the wave. Warwick's moving topside and can potentially help out the Victor. Are we dead off that? Oh, I thought Lilia might ult. If she does, we might have been in a little bit of trouble. No. Okay, let's go topside. See what we can do. Warwick likes to get in the fight with the Mumu. It's going to be a 3v2 for the moment. We're going to try and come in here, see if we can help out. No, we barely are unable to get in range. We do get a kill back though, which is pretty good. I could TP, I could uh, flash forward, but I'm going to avoid doing so. In case there's more enemies here. We can help the smolder mid lane. I'm going to go for the Lux, maybe. Hmm. Maybe not. Nice, good stun. I didn't have my ult, unfortunately. We're just coming up. Should be able to get the Briar now. The Briar? The Zaya. She's on her own. Should be able to get quite a lot, but... Should be a dead Zaya. Warwick's going to be there as well. Going to be able to sniff her out. She's going to have to keep running. And if she does get this far back, 
we should be able to find her anyway. Huge. Got enough for our Rift Maker now. That's going to be really, really nice, I think. Going to hopefully push another way before we go back. Our Rift Maker, yes, I didn't think about it before, especially against a Mumu. Once we get a Conqueror Prox combined with a little bit of Rift Maker, I think we can have really nice healing, actually. Nice. Let's go ahead and reset. And then Jack Show, guys. And then we're going to be actually tanky, I think. Hope you guys are enjoying this one. I'm enjoying this one quite a lot, actually. Cannon feels a little bit fun. Pretty cool to play. Uh, I'll get the armor, but we don't really need the armor, to be honest. We more need the magic resistance and stuff. Okay, smolder's already smoldering. Next rate's coming up in 145. We definitely need that. Whoops. I clicked this without... Whilst I was in uh, lightning form. Someone will come bot side here. Maybe Zaya comes back bot. If so, we can definitely kill her for free. We're strong enough to do that right now. Even without all. No one? Nobody? I can see Lily up there. I can see two people mid. The Lux and the Rakan. There's the Zaya. Does she know? She queued and then she walked away. Okay, all for all, I'm okay with that. Oh no, the tower. We do get the Zyra in the end, which is huge. Rakan kills me as well. No, the tower. I take too many tower shots. I'm going to be up in time. I can see Peter the Drake. Getting her ult though is pretty good, but it might be up in time, I'm not sure. Having my ult is maybe a little bit more important. We do need to go for this Drake though, which is important. If not, they get Sol. Team are doing a good job of sieging here, playing it slow. Just have to be a little bit careful. One engage from Amumu into the uh, Lux CC. Gonna be a bit rough. Yeah, bot lane needs to go down. Vic has TP, yeah, so he can definitely stay. We'll get a Chain Vest for now. I lied, we'll sell this. And then we will buy the Null Magic Mantle. I think it's going to be a little bit more important. We're going to TP down here. Help him out straight away. Our bot lane should definitely be here. It's really bad that our bot lane are only coming back now. This is really bad. Yeah, it's really bad that our bot lane weren't there, unfortunately. They managed to get it for free now, which is not so good. We're going to keep auto-attacking here. We're going to do a lot of damage with the... I can, I can move with the uh, Rift Maker and stuff. Nice. Yeah, a little bit of macro error there. Our bot lane was top lane for way too long, and it means that they can get a lot of prior on the Drake. And it ended up only being me in the Warwick. Good job by TP to help him out, but unfortunately, it doesn't really work out, and they do get the Infernal Sword. Hopefully we can trade back the Baron though. Which should be pretty good. Nice. I keep my stacked up W. See if anyone walks forward. Okay. Oh, my W is barely out of range. Victor's going to TP bot here. Okay. Should be able to get this for free. Stack up my W again. Oh my gosh. That luck damage is crazy. Victor's splitting bot is pretty good. He's really strong on his own. I have to be a little bit careful. Oh my gosh, big damage. Yumi owing a little bit early, I think. A Mumu dealing with the Victor is pretty good, so we should be able to siege here, hopefully. It's going to hit the tower as much as I can. Wow, that smolder hurts, man. Victor, again, getting the bot side. We don't need to pressure too much. 
I can go for the Flash R here, but I don't have Zonyas like I normally would do on Kennen, so it's going to be a little bit rough. Just let Victor do his thing there. We're going to continue to just chill out for a little bit. I keep my stacked up W. Get this for free. Nice stuff. Oh, nice play from Smolder. Does she die? She does. Oh, I tried to get the flash auto into the W onto her, but we miss it, unfortunately. We're going to come down now. See if we can maybe chase the Rakan. We can't. Four of them are still alive. Wasted my flash there, which is a little bit unfortunate, but we might have to reset if we're not too careful here. Oh, the Lilia going for the play. Not the best play, I think, from the Lilia. We're going to have an ult here. Just outside the range. Nice stuff. Take down the Lilia. Take down the Mumu as well. Rakan stepping forward a little bit too far. I think he's probably going to go down. He does. Don't need Zaya left. And that's going to be GG, guys. Really nice stuff from the team. Oh my gosh, that's more that hurts so much. GG, guys. Alright, summoners. Went ahead and honored the Warwick there, I think. He played really, really well. It was pretty chill. Some nice ganks top side as well. And one of the most chilled out Warwick players I've had in a while, to be honest. Damage wise, wow, we did number one on our team. No way. Smolder was very close, but our damage was crazy, guys. On hit Kennen with this build seems pretty fun. You guys gotta try it out too. And if you guys enjoy, smash a like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video.